First it was Neymar. Now it's Mbappe. The proud owners of the world's third best player, Paris Saint-Germain have shelled out 180 million euros for Monaco's 18-year-old forward. For fans of the club, having star players join their team is a dream come true. Since Neymar arrived, there's been a lot more enthusiasm. We can feel the public has more hope in our possibility of winning the European Cup, because that's really our objective now. We're missing that star. It's true the Marseille fans always take the mickey because of that, so we'd like to level the score. The club's fortunes changed after they were purchased by Qatari investors in 2011. Bigger budgets have drawn more and more footballing talent to the Parisian powerhouse. For fans, the astronomical sums of money spent are just a continuation of the status quo. You have to live with your time. PSG is a great club now. It was like this in other clubs before, so there you go. Paris is now part of the top five. It's normal for there to be a lot of money at stake. Before buying Kylian Mbappe, PSG had already spent an outstanding 220 million euros for Neymar, more than double the 105 million paid by Manchester United for Paul Pogba in 2016. So how can a club with an annual revenue of just over 500 million euros in 2016 afford such sums? Once a country owns a club, uh, everything is possible. And uh, so it becomes very difficult to respect uh, a financial fair play because you can have different ways or different interests for a country to have such a big player to represent the country. UEFA's financial fair play rules state that a club cannot build up unsustainable debt in the pursuit of success. Some expect that the exchange will be found to have breached FFP rules by the time PSG's accounts are reviewed, an allegation that the club's president denies. I have a very strong team with me, working really day and night, just applying you know, with the regulation of uh, financial fair play. So whoever thinking about financial fair play, I tell them, please, Go have coffee and don't worry about us. We are, we are in, in good hands. Thank you. Al Khalifi predicts Neymar's worth will double in the next two to three years and says that the club's value rose from 1 to 1.5 billion euros as a result of Neymar signing. If Mbappe ends up having the same impact, the result could spell magic for fans and investors alike.